Dennis starts off this hour in Charlotte, North Carolina. Hi, Dennis. How are you? Hey, Dave. Hey, uh, good thanks, and uh, thanks for taking my call. Certainly, sir. How can I help? Uh, okay, here's the deal. Uh, my wife and I just bought a house, and uh, we are able to put 60% down because we just sold our other house. Phenomenal. So uh, along with that, we picked up a mortgage. So mm-hmm. I want to slam the mortgage. Mm-hmm. So I'm thinking we got a we got a 30 year just to get on the boards. I'm thinking going to a 15 year real soon. Mm-hmm. And I'm also also provided I can we can handle that. We think we can. Provided we can do that. I'm also thinking about taking we got 14 or 15 in uh, mutual funds. And mm-hmm. I'm thinking about taking that out as well and throwing that on the mortgage as well. Mm-hmm. To really get this thing down. How much do you now, owe? Go ahead. How much do you owe? Uh, 132. Okay. And what is your interest rate? Uh, 3.6. 3.685. And you I just got it? We just got it, yeah. Really? Interesting. It's a yeah. little, it's a little yeah. high. Okay. Well, I thought so. I thought so. But we were, we wanted to just get this thing, you know, done and get in the house and then start. Is it a traditional working. mortgage? It is, yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, and, and your household income, sir? Oh, um, I'm retired. I think we're at about sixty. Okay. You have any money other than the fourteen thousand? Uh, no. Okay. All right. Do you you don't we have an emergency? Have social, do you have an emergency social security fund? Security is coming in. Okay. Do you have an emergency fund of any kind? Um. Yeah. Yeah. We we've got about twenty. Uh, set aside. Okay. All right. In a separate account, different than the fourteen. Correct. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I'm with your plan. I would throw the 14 at it, um, which gets us, you know, uh, you know, down in the one what, 118 or something like that. We got left then, and uh, you can put that on a 15 year. Normally, the only reason to refinance is not to go from a 30 to a 15. I wouldn't go to the refinance cost to do that, uh, but in order to save on interest, you would refinance. And I think you could probably save three quarters of a point. I mean, I'm seeing quotes. I don't know if you can get on a mortgage this small or not. But I'm seeing quotes well down under, um, uh, under three. And so, if you got something like two point eight seven five or two seven five or something like that, along those lines, you know that would might be worth refinancing. And then while you're at it, put it on a fifteen year. And then, of course, you just chunk money at it as fast and as hard as you can, like you're saying. And then, how do we make that go away? Well, you make it go away pretty quick that way. You're probably done in five or six years. Mm, that's now we're talking the same language. Yeah. yeah. Okay. And you just start, you just kind of start dividing it. You know, you just say we're dealing with what, 120,000. And, you mm, know, that, if we wanted to do that in 10 years, that'd be 10,000 extra um, mm, a year. Um, yeah. You know, and if we wanted to do it in five years, that means it'd be 20,000 extra a year. That's right. Yeah. yeah so that's okay. why I'm saying, you know, five, six, seven years, something like that, you're probably going to be done. Mm, mm. Okay. Can I make one statement? Sure. One last statement. I know my daughter's listening to this right now, and she'll squeeze blood out of the rock as far as uh, um, uh, her budget goes. Mm-hmm. Want to want to tell her that we're gonna, mom and dad are gonna take care of her car payment from here on. We're gonna wipe out her debt. Oh wow! And, uh, just want, gonna use this opportunity to do that. She's not expecting this, but I thought I'd want to do this. But okay, Dave. Thanks very much. I well, that's fun. Time. That's the first time anybody's ever announced that on our show. That's very cool. Well uh, done, sir. <laughs>